Hey, Diane Beavis here, and we've got Kim Smith helping us out here at the new rail training facility. It's a phenomenal facility. Uh, we're going to be working on a, basically a complex training set today. We call it uh, basically strength to power, and we're going to be focusing on a rear elevated split squat in order to focus on strength. The very first movement, Ken's going to get set up here, nice position, the foot's going to be elevated on a bench or on a box, and then he's going to go down into a squat. And this is a split squat, but it should look just like a regular single leg squat or double leg squat. Same position where as he goes down, the torso's nice and parallel with the shin. He's got a nice vertical neutral position with the spine. He loads down nice and deep with those dumbbells right to his hip position. He's going to press through on the way up through the heel, so he's got a nice strong extension at the top. Perfect, just like that. We're going to go right from that position, that strength position, right into an explosive single leg uh, hurdle hop. So it's a hop because it's single leg to single leg on the same leg. Good. And basically, we're basically following up the strength move with this explosive or plyometric so that we're actually looking at motor neuron activation and the uh, reflex potentiation that really gets enhanced with this strength to uh, explosive movement. So we're going to show you one more time. Good job. Just like that. So those are two really intense movements. So we're going to choose um, an upper body movement in a different pillar of human movements so that we're getting nice active recovery but still getting a lot of great work done. So we're doing a dive bomber push up. It loads the shoulders with a high hip position. He's going to drive his shoulders right down towards his hands. He's going to finish into a plank position and then he's going to push back and reset the hips in a high position. So he's basically, the, from the name, dive bombing right from the, down, from the head, forehead to the ground, shoulders right towards the hands, really loading the shoulders a little bit more on this push-up position. And that's it. That's perfect right there. So we've got those three movements. This really helps with your power production, your force production. And we will see you next month.